Please pause for a moment of silent reflection. drawing or painting you'd like to feature on the moment of silence, visit wbmsvideo.com slash mozart to send your ear work. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today is Constitution Day. Here is a video to celebrate. Hey, do you know about the USA? Do you know about the government? Can you tell me about the Constitution? Hey, learn about the USA. In 1787, untold our found. principles down on paper and called it the Constitution. And it's been helping us run our country ever since then. The first part of the Constitution is called the Preamble and tells what those founding fathers set out to do. We the people, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility. Provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare and hand, secure the blessings of liberty to ourselves and our posterity. Do ordain and establish this constitution for the United States of America. In 1787, I'm told our family all sat down and wrote a list of principles that's known the world around. The USA was just starting out a whole brand new country, and so our people spelled it out. They wanted a land of liberty, and the preamble goes like this. We the people, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare, and secure the blessings of liberty to ourselves and our posterity. Do ordain and establish this constitution. Flourishing Friday, we will continue with organizational tips and tricks to help you be successful. In this one, we'll focus on time management. Managing time can lead to being more efficient. By planning your time, you are less likely to forget commitments or due dates, such as time with family and friends or homework deadlines. As you transition from middle school to high school and high school to college, your commitments will increase. Working on time management skills now can make organizing these future commitments far easier. The dictionary defines time management as the analysis of how daily hours are spent. How are your daily hours spent? Do you have enough time in a day to get everything done, or do you always feel rushed and behind? Getting organized can help you with your time management. Keeping a calendar or using electronic reminders can be helpful. 
There are other ways you can stay organized, like keeping a timeline or to-do list of short-term and long-term commitments. You can also keep a family or personal calendar. How is your life currently organized? Let's consider an example, your backpack. What does it look like? Messy? Disorganized? Have a trusted adult or friend help you organize it. Well, that's it for today. For more tips and tricks, to visit wbmsvideo.com slash Flourishing Friday. First Jewish Club meeting on Monday, September 19th. We will meet right after school in the teacher cafe. Tell your parents to pick you up at 5.15 p.m. Don't miss the fun or the donuts. All are welcome. Junior Raiders Boys Basketball Tryouts will have their second tryout this Sunday, September 18th at Alpharetta High School. 6th grade will be from 1 to 3 p.m. and 7th and 8th grade will be from 3 to 5 p.m. Register at tiny.url.com slash 2p9emdh6. Junior Lady Raider Tryouts will be held this Saturday at Alfreda High School. 6th grade will be from 12 to 2 p.m. in the Ox Gym. 7th and 8th grade will be 12 to 2 p.m. in the main gym. Bingo! Save the date for bingo. Don't miss out on this prize-packed afternoon of bingo, pizza, prizes, and more. Join us on Tuesday, September 20th from 4.15 to 5.45 in the cafeteria for an afternoon with your friends and a chance to win some awesome prizes. For only $5, you can enjoy a slice of pizza and a drink and receive two bingo cards. If you're still hungry, you can purchase a slice of pizza, a drink, or candy for only $1. You need to have a guardian or a parent to sign an online permission form and pay the participation fee prior to the event. Ask them to go to PTA website to sign up or check out Friday Notes this week for more information. Do you feel lucky? Shout out to Sanika. She won all three single matches and won two of the three mixed doubles matches at the USTA Level 5 Clay Court Championships in Auburn. Today in Compass, 6th and 8th graders will have Friday Fun Day. 7th graders will continue reading a long walk to water. Here's what's on the lunch menu for today. Here's tomorrow's breakfast menu. Today's SAT word of the day is nomadic, wandering from place to place. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, Jaguars. Miss an announcement? Subscribe to our YouTube channel and revisit announcements and more. Teachers, have an announcement? Email us at wbmsnews at bulletinschools.org.